Howdy guys, in today's video we're going to be looking at our production manager from our Printing Basics mini series. And this will be done for Flexi Print. But before that, let's have a quick intro first. So today's video can be found on softwaretraining.co.za. We make short and easy to watch problem solving videos and we also have daily updates. Otherwise, we're back to the program here. Now in the previous few videos, we looked at setting up our print. Now we're gonna be looking at how to get this to the actual production manager. Now, like I mentioned before, by default, our send mode is set to send now. And what that will do is once you click at the bottom here, send, it's going to send it to production manager, start the ripping and printing, all of that automatically. Now for the sake of the tutorial, I'm going to set this here to hold in list. We obviously, like I mentioned before, have saved files. So if you want to copy to a flash drive and do it manually, you can do that. So now if I go in my production manager, you can currently see we have uh, an empty session. So I'm just going to click send here at the bottom, then on top you've got status holding software training so over here also if we just clicked if we said send now it would show you when it's ripping and uh, actual sending but now if we head back to production manager you'll see now we have something here so we've got a few different options with the setup which is the printer job name and then we've got the current status which is holding because i said set it to that then who sent it and then we've got the dimensions, copies, so more information on your actual design. Now from here, you can simply just then click the rip if you want. And then click that. And then, so yeah, obviously, if you the drop down, you can view your logs and so forth. But we're just going to click rip. And you see the process here shows us that it is busy ripping the file. And then once that is done and you are ready, you can simply click send and then it will communicate with your actual printer and get the file printed. But yeah, otherwise that is it on the basics of printing. Pretty straightforward. Obviously keep in mind the settings within Production Manager you will have to set up. We have covered that in another mini series before, so definitely check that out if you have not already. But otherwise, yeah, thanks for following along on this mini series. In the meanwhile though, if you guys head to softwaretraining.co.za, you will notice we've got a variety of different softwares we do cover, and you can also isolate your search on the top right. If you do not however find what you're looking for, like the videos, you can always go here, yeah, request a training video, then we'll do our best to try and make that for you. But otherwise, thanks guys for watching, and cheers.